development in this case, the Harris County Sheriff's Office Homicide Division putting this video out. They want the entire community to see it. They say someone has to recognize this man. They say he was seen driving Pamela Johnson's car, and they want to know if you know who he is. Look closely at this video. This man was seen driving, then dropping off Pamela Johnson's car and walking through Willowbrook Mall. Witnesses discovered the missing 2004 PT Cruiser yesterday. After reviewing the video, detectives say this man dropped the car and walked through around 11 in the morning. They say he didn't buy anything but walked through the mall around 10 minutes before leaving. The car was discovered later in the day. Detectives say they don't know if he is the man responsible for Johnson's death, but they are sure he was driving her car yesterday. Yesterday. Now this was a heinous crime and so there's always a sense of urgency with these cases and that's why we're here today. We want to make sure we get this information out as quickly as possible. We know a lot of people will be at home on a Sunday evening. And so we really need the public's help just like they helped us locate the PT Cruiser. We want to see if anyone out there can help us identify this individual. If you recognize the man, call Crime Stoppers at 713-222-TIPS or the Harris County Sheriff's Office. Detectives say they are looking at similarities in this case and one other crime in that same area, but are not ready to link the two. And I spoke with the youngest sister of Pamela Johnson, who lives out of state by phone about this most recent development. And she says that the family is thrilled with this development. They are hoping it will lead to, of course, more developments. Now, if you want to take a closer look at this man at this video, you can go to ABC13.com or our ABC13 app. Live with the Harris County Sheriff's Office downtown, Christine Dobbin, 13 Eyewitness News. Christine.